Hi, this is Colleen Perry with Positively Wagon. I'm based in Memphis, Tennessee. Um, I'm also a licensed Family Pause parent educator, and I'm here with my son, Oren, who's two. And today we're going to demonstrate something that um, we talk about a lot in the Family Pause programs called Guided Touch. So this is something you can start when kids are very young. We started with him and my daughter, who's now four, um, when they started showing interest in the dogs and wanted to touch them. Um, so this is a way to safely allow your children to pet your dogs and to teach them to be gentle and to be careful and safe around dogs. So when we do guided touch, we do palm to palm so that we can guide the child and teach them how to pet. And here's Athena, so we're going to pet, pet, and then we wait for her to ask for more. So right now she's going over to the other dog and she doesn't want any more right now, so we wait. So this one's coming and wants to be pet. So we pet, pet, and then we wait and see if he wants more. And so he a says, couple yeah. quick notes about where we pet dogs. Um, we always start at the base of the neck and move to the shoulder blades, and that's it. We don't go down towards the rear end. We never go near the face. We go for that part of the dog. Um, and two pets, pet, pet paws is the phrase that we use at Family Paws. Um, and that way we wait and see if the dog wants more. We always um, make sure that the dog comes to us and asks to be pet and asks to interact. And we always make sure that we have a good experience when we do it. So if the child is fussy, if they're not sitting still, if they're trying to hit, then we don't do it. Um, kids develop their motor skills very slowly and so sometimes they're trying to do gentle touch and instead of doing gentle touch they're hitting because that's all they know how to do that's all their motor skills allow them to do other times they'll go to pet the dog and they'll grab because that's where their motor skills are at so by starting young you can get them used to that action and being gentle and then as they get older they know what they're supposed to be doing with dogs